we're going to place some numbers here into scientific notation. You hopefully have already watched the presentation on how to make significant figures. And you need to know how many significant figures you have in the number before you can place it into scientific notation. Scientific notation is to deal with very large numbers and very small numbers, with many, many decimal places. So let's start with these four over here. We have 182000. According to our significant figure rules, there are one, two, three significant figures in this number. And then we're assuming there's a decimal place right here at the end of this number. So we're going to actually capture how many decimal places we have to move in order to reach right after the first digit. So it will be, the answer will be 1.82 times 10. And how many steps do we need to get that decimal point between the 1 and the 8? It's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 steps. That's times 10 to the positive 5. Three significant figures times 10 to the positive 5. 63.01. How many significant figures are there? There's 1, 2, 3, 4. All four digits are significant. So the answer will be 6. 0.301 times 10, and how many digits we had to move this to get it at between the first, after the first digit? It's one decimal place, times 10 to the first. And here's a small number, it's much less than one, so it's going to have a negative exponent. We have how many significant digits? One, two. These are the only two significant digits in this number. So the answer is going to be 1.0 times 10. Now how many decimal places does it take to get this into scientific notation? It's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. It's 8 decimal places and because the number is less than 1, it's in negative direction. The final one, we have $2 billion. So we have two with a bunch of zeros right after it. That's the point assumed to be at the end. The number of significant figures here, according to our rules, is only one. There's only the one digit, and that's the two, times ten to how many decimal places? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And since it's a large number greater than one, it's 10 to the 9th. And that's how we place numbers into scientific notation.